Comics Plus, what's going on? My name is Aka's son. How are you guys doing? Hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. So, I wanted to get this uh, news out the way really quick. And uh, something uh, that occurred about six hours ago, actually. Now, take this with a grain of salt or whatever the case may be. But it's very possible, very possible. We're just going to put this in the rumor mill for now. Just a rumor mill, speculation that it is very possible that the original face of Peter Parker, John Bubniak, uh, might be coming back in some form or fashion to Spider-Man PS4 or PS4 Remastered or so. It's very possible. Let me go ahead and take a look, uh, show you guys where I was earlier today. On Twitter, you can go ahead and follow me at AKASAN. A at A-K-A-S-A-N and um, John Bubniak uh, which uh, did the original face until he was replaced by Ben Jordan I believe uh, for New Face Peter it caused a lot of controversy right um, he doesn't really post too often but he did post on his Twitter a little earlier today about six hours ago and he just uh, simply said ayo and as you can expect as you can expect he was flooded by a bunch of people asking for him to come back. Asking, including myself. Including myself. Um. <laughs> Amen said, please back, bro. Please. <laughs> like. <laughs> but, okay. Okay. Here's something, regardless of whether you like it or not, we already, we just did an extensive video comparing Old Face Peter to New Face Peter. And actually, a lot of that might have to come down to performance mode. Um, it, I was not feeling it, but actually watching it again on a better capture on YouTube, um, it actually was fitting. It's not great, but it is, it is good. So, uh, regardless of all of that, I ended up posting uh, about six hours ago, and I'm like, Sup, bro, when you coming back, right? And um, there is a guy, a Red Reddit Nation member, who actually posted early on. He was like, um, okay, very interesting. So, he was first to post, feel like pure shit, just bring back Bubniak, right? Bubniak replies a minute later. I'm right here, brother. Josh replies. Your version of the character made me connect with him in a way that no other version has. Version. Ver version. Version. This didn't have to happen. 2020 sucks. John replies. Thanks a lot, man. Ah, good things are coming. Thanks a lot, man. Ah, good things are coming. What does he mean? What does he mean? What does he mean? Oh boy, does that mean, ladies and gentlemen, does that mean that old face Peter is coming back in some form or fashion? What do we make of that? Um, because my the whole thing, you can look at it two ways, is the fact that good things are coming. Josh said, your version of that blah, 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 this didn't have to happen, 2020 sucks. So 2020 sucks. Thanks a lot, man. But ah, good things are coming in terms of like 2020 is almost over, right? Very possible. That's one way to look at it. Or if you want to be optimistic, you can look at it in the sense that Insomniac has not... Re I would say if I'm being generous, if I'm being generous, it's a 50-50 split on New Face Peter. Um, 
And this is not taking into consideration the Twitter world. Because, you know, everybody on Twitter likes to complain. So I'm not even taking that into consideration. But, you know, um, when you start adding in just people just looking at it from a, a, from a, I think looking at it from a people that didn't actually buy the remastered and just, they're just seeing what's circulating online, right? I don't think it's working. And I think Insomniac uh is aware of something like this and so it's very very possible very possible that um you know they might just go ahead and uh throw in um old face peter in the remaster maybe we'll get a patch or some sort of update that's it's very possible they're gonna yeah exactly they're gonna pull a sonic the hedgehog insomniac type of deal maybe that's possible who knows so like i said we're just gonna gonna, gonna, gonna stick a pin in this but it does seem just kind of weird that the the kind of interaction so much interaction that he had with our one red reddit nation member here and i appreciate josh for getting a reply here bring you know bring back bubniak right he replies back i'm right here brother i mean he didn't really have to even say that right um you know, thanks a lot. Good thing. It, it seems like he, you know, I don't know. I don't know. Um, let me see if there's anything. Did, did he, did he, uh, did he like my thing? Actually, let me see if he even liked my comment. No, no. He doesn't know that I exist. No. Oh, well. Okay. That's damn. But I want to know if she, that's what, okay. She liked my comment. Okay. We're gonna, Hawkinson's gonna have to look back into that. Uh, and she fo mm, she follows me. Mm. <laughs> Hawkinson has some uh, extracurricular activity to uh, do a little bit later tonight. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, let me see. Did he reply to anybody else? Uh, maybe. Okay. Okay. Somebody's like, I miss you. Gives gives him some love. Okay. Nope. That's about it. Um. Okay, yeah, we don't need to see that. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> Insomniac Games, you ruined what I love the most. Bring back Bubniak. Wow. Okay. Very interesting. Um, I'm very, I'm very, I'm very curious to see where this goes. So, Red Red Nation, stand up, speak up. Let me know what you guys. <laughs> Why are you quoting Toby Maguire? No. Let me know what you guys think about all this. Stand up, speak up, and um, <laughs> we'll talk to you in the next rumor mail. We're out. Peace.